Hello everyone, my name is Sophia and I am a student at the University of Bristol and I also work within the marketing and content creation team here at Accommodation for Students and today we're going to be discussing all things rent guarantors. So let's get straight into it. So when you rent a student property within the UK you need to provide a rent guarantor. So a lot of you who are renting for the first time might be wondering what is a rent guarantor, who can this be and I'm going to explain that to you today. So your rent guarantor is a person who's going to be responsible for your payments if if you fail to pay your rent so if there's any time there's an instance and you can't pay the rent this person is then liable for it now this term may seem really daunting or confusing but don't worry I'm gonna explain this a little bit more so in the UK a guarantor is someone who is liable for a loan that has already been taken out occasionally they are responsible for paying the rent that you are unable to pay occasionally they'll be responsible as well for covering damages to the property but this will be discussed and written up in your contract so why is a rent guarantor needed so it's quite understandable when you ask for a rent guarantor it kind of feels like that the landlord isn't trusting you to pay your rent but really it is just a kind of safety net most landlords request one of these it's nothing personal so you don't need to be worried about that it's pretty standard here in the UK it basically offers just the landlord a bit of security in case the renter defaults on their rent and it just means for them that they are still going to get paid. So some instances where a rent guarantor is needed is obviously if you're a student, if it's your first time privately renting, if you've been living in a different country or if you've been temporarily unemployed or if you don't have a steady income. So even if you're sat there thinking well none of these apply to me there is still a chance your landlord is going to ask for a guarantor. So now we have a better understanding of what a guarantor is you may be sat there thinking well who actually qualifies to be my rent guarantor? So it can actually be really difficult for a lot of people to secure a UK based rent guarantor so there are some requirements that your guarantor needs to meet. So they must be between the ages of 18 to 75, they must have a good credit history you must be able to pay your monthly rent they must be a UK resident in case legal action needs to be taken and they must be able to prove that they can meet this criteria so for most students your parents can act as your guarantor but for some this isn't the case particularly with international students some people might also be a bit more concerned about being a rent guarantor as it means you can take responsibility for the whole house if you're in a house share so it's really important to check your contract before you sign to check whether your guarantor will be liable just for you or for the whole house so if you're unable to find a rent guarantor then there are a few things you can do so you can pay your rent up front landlords may ask for six to twelve months up front or you could try finding accommodation that does not require a rent guarantor so for instance some private halls or residents they don't require this at all you could also try a rent guarantor housing company such as housing hand who can basically act as your guarantor for a small fee so you can actually spread these payments across a range of installments so it's not like you're paying a massive chunk to them all in one go which is really great if you have any more questions you can live chat right now with one of the team or you can email us the address is support at accommodationforstudents.com. 